What is the saddest moment of your life? In March 2022, I got a voice message from my mum and our family app. At this time I was in school, our class just ended and I was still sitting in the classroom. I put on my headphones to listen to what my mum sent me. All of a sudden I felt sick to my stomach. I played the message and I heard heavy breathing. My mum started speaking, she explained she and my dad had been in a car crash. Her voice was breaking and I couldn't tell if it was because of the pain, or that it was because she had been crying. She said that our dad had passed on impact. She also said that our dad loved us and cared about us. At this point I started to cry, I was still sitting in the classroom, unable to move, listening to my mum explaining that she and dad loved us, that we needed to take care of each other, be there for each other, and protect each other. After that she said she loved us one more time, and then it stopped. I couldn't believe what just happened. I was hoping it wasn't real, a part of me still thought they were alive. I saw my brother in the hallway, messing and laughing with his friends. After he said goodbye to his friends, he saw me, he came over to the doorway, calling my name. I wasn't able to answer, I was having a panic attack. Classmates looked at me like I was nuts, but for once I couldn't care less. My brother came over to me, asking what was wrong, I wasn't able to speak, and how do you tell your brother that his parents passed? I pulled off my headphones and put it on his head, with my shaking hands. I pressed play. I watched my brother's facial expression going from worried to panicking and crying. Shortly after this our sister called. I picked up, we knew that the other one knew. We didn't really talk to each other, we just sat there. About an hour later two policemen came into my class. They took me and my brother, and we went into the car. The whole ride was silent, the policemen didn't say anything, but I could see their sad facial expressions. Once we arrived at the bureau, we saw our sister there. The three of us just hugged and cried for a bit. We all sat down, the three of us and the two policemen. The policemen explained to us that our parents had been in a car crash that involved a driver under the influence. The driver apparently had some minor injuries. At this point I just felt numb and sad for the most part. In between staring at the wall or the floor, I asked the policemen some details, mostly about the driver. The weeks after that were blurry, I only remember that we were trying to stay together, because my brother and I were still minors, we didn't want to end up in foster homes. It has been almost a year now, it's been the toughest year of my life. We still live in the house of our parents, our sister was able to be our legal guardian. We take care of each other, like my mum asked us to. Sometimes I wonder how it would be if they would still be here, don't get me wrong I have a great bond with my siblings, but I miss our parents, I know my brother and sister also do.